This week, an Oklahoma father of two became the latest American tourist to be detained under a new firearm law in the Caribbean territory of Turks and Caicos. The arrest comes as a Virginia man faces up to 12 years in prison after airport security allegedly found ammunition in his carry-on bag earlier this month. Our Chris Van Cleve reports. Michael, CBS News has learned at least four Americans are facing lengthy prison sentences in the Turks and Caicos over ammo in their bags. Now, we've spoken to families of three of the four, and in each case, they insist this was accidental and unintentional. But Turks and Caicos has a very strict law about guns and ammo. Even possessing a bullet or two can lead to the potential of a mandatory minimum sentence of 12 years in prison. And while there are some exemptions for special circumstances, a recent court ruling in that country held that if the crime comes with a mandatory prison sentence, that even a tourist has to serve some time behind bars if convicted. Previously, they were able to pay a fine often uh, and leave it at that. But now you have Americans that are facing potentially even years in prison. We spoke with one man who spent nearly six months in a Turks and Caicos prison over this issue, some ammo found in his luggage while he was on vacation. In each case, the people are, were in the process of leaving the country when this was found. Uh, we know that right now there are three men on the island who cannot leave. One remains behind bars. The other two are out on bail but can't go home to their families and are waiting to go through the court system to find out if they'll have to go to prison over what amounts to a small amount of ammo potentially accidentally left in their bags. The governor of Oklahoma is calling for the release of at least one of them who is an Oklahoma resident. And pressure certainly is growing here in the U.S. as this story gets traction, Michael. Chris Van Cleef, thanks.